Okay, are we ready? Okay, so this is the left triple. Sorry, I always have to write things. So, so when I say left and right triple, there are two triples, aren't there? Yeah. So when you do this, you could either be that. So they're different triples. Okay, so Nikolai gave us three colouring of the triple. Do we agree that this is a colouring? Yes. And it's crossing. This is 3 1. At least now. Uh, Nikolai did. Whoa. Okay, great. 7 4. 7 4. 7 4. Does everyone agree that this is a, a colouring of 7 4? Yes. See, this is yes. each crossing. Yes. So 2 3 1. 1 3 2. Uh, at least you're all done. And it's in one. Well, this is color coded, so it's a bit easier. Oh, well done. Who, who did this? Well done. And Daria did this one. At least No, it's excellent. Okay. So I've got, I think I've got. Maxime and Andre onto a, a, a problem. Uh, so uh, let's look at some more, constructing some more examples. Sorry to erase your wonderful picture. So just uh, look at some more examples of knots. So here's, maybe I'll start with. Uh, this is called the the uh, two in torus knot, torus knot, and just so I don't, for example, the trifold. Okay, so firstly, let's just understand these these examples. So these are called two in torus knot, but let's just think about where this in comes from. So the n, so n is 1, means that I have, so I always, so all I'm doing is increasing the number of twists in the middle. Okay. So the, and n is 1, means that the strand goes under once, when I go down. When I start at the top right, okay, it just goes under once. Okay. This one, if I start at the top right, I go under one, two. Okay. And you could do for all of them. And the question is, which n, n is this knot? Or maybe to be more precise, not diagram. Okay, so in your, in your books, Play with it a little bit, and I'll, I'll write another problem. And this one is called the in twisted double of the unknot. And let me explain the, the number here. So the left hand side looks the same. Okay. But the if I put my finger on the top right, then I cross over this guy, this other strand once. If I put my finger on the top right here, 
I go over the bottom, the, the other strand once, twice. Start here. To get to here, I cross over the other strand twice. So again, with forge in colorable. Next thing you you're pointing. Residue. Residue. Remainder. If remainder of n on three is one, if n is one more three. No, if n can be written as three k plus one, yeah, it is colorable, and if if not, it isn't. Uh, would, can you would you like to prove it or sketch it to us? So, so mix again. So mix mix uh, just in English we say if this is the case that we say n is one modulo three. Yes. So this is trifold. It is colorable. For example, like if this part is one. And this two, then we can color this three, and here one, two, three, and here, here two, three, one, and here three, two, one. It is colorful. So if we have a big. Чем вам так Let us consider these two parts are uh, colors in the same color, one and one. Then this is one, this is one, this is one, this is one, and it is all the color one. This is not coloring because we have definition of color. So uh, let us uh, consider this, this is color one and this is color two. Then this is color three and this is color three two. And we uh, sh uh, we should uh, we should have uh, the number of these crossings uh, that uh, is one mod three modulo modulo three and we have the number of uh, each uh, if n is one more we have two more crossings and if we have two more crossings uh, this construction uh, would have crash because because they have to номера проставьте немножко все поймут вот прямо сверху идите ставьте номера ну вот и все если там не будет модуль один то просто не сойдется иначе сойдется то есть там картинка три а потом один два три один два три один два три да Все хорошо.